Hi and welcome back to Blasphemous where we want to explore the depth of mercy dreams everything that's below this place where I just reached That's the second gate we opened and that's the one that I haven't looked beyond Ouch. So I assume no more shortcuts. So left or right? Let's look into the left. That leads to another place. Interesting. Let's look to the right first before we leave here. But that may also be a shortcut thingy. And here's more. Okay more level to the right let's look at this rift in the thing to the left okay there's oh a merchant let us be captives of the miracle penitent one do not be surprised to find this merchant here this ancient occupation requires me to be wherever I can obtain rewarding benefits. Call me Candelaria, for what I sell would make your eyes light up like the high bonfires. I want that key. I will not ask you for any money whatsoever. Those forbidden tears you shed would be more than enough for me. Go ahead. Cast your darkened eyes over these valuable treasures. Candelaria, the merchant, okay. Behold what I present to you. Though a small piece, its great power should not be underestimated. <laughs> Trust me, for I have the blood of kings on the palm of my hand. Key to the chamber of the eldest brother. That's the key I need. A forbidden key that was guarded by the eldest brother of the brotherhood, but it was eventually lost, thus forever sealing the chamber it opens. What I am offering you here is as lustrous as the first star of the night. And may my eyes be blinded if I'm lying. The hollow pearl, empty varnished sphere. There is no trace of nacre left, but it retains just a hint of bluish sheen. It creates fervor when destroying surrounding objects. Okay, that's for the uh, for the rose rose beads, rose rosary beads. Yeah, that's a rosary bead. Okay. What I am offering you here is as lustrous as the first star of the night. And may my eye. Moss preserved in glass. Minute jar filled with moss. The tiny white flowers that shimmer inside can grant some protection against toxins. Toxic protection. That's great. I will need that. Behold but... what I protrust me. But I'm buying the key. And I acquired the key. Uh, not available, yeah. Forbidden key that was guarded. Uh, yeah, we have had that. I hear his lament, the one who was believed mute from the beginning since there were witnesses to the first miracle. The afflicted one who asked for punishment and had it granted to him. I hear his lament. Even if the father is no longer with us, even if only his images, large and small, remain in all the sacred places, I hear his lament. It is the miracle that makes me hear it. This is my punishment as the eldest brother and guardian of this congregation, congregation whose mystery is the silence of the father. I hear his lament and I don't want to hear it anymore. I will have yours cover his. That is my penance. Okay. There's more to the mercy dreams. Let's have 
sneak peek, but I want to really, I really want to try out the key. Where's the... Ouch. Okay, can't block that. Great. Oh, that's a thing I couldn't cross before. I thought I was choosing a path there, but that's just a path back. Are we doing path of pain here? Oh no. This is real. Oh. I'm doing stupid stuff because I'm pressing wrong buttons again. Oh my god. Pressing wrong buttons again. Oh. Okay. I want to check out that key though, so that's what I'm doing now. Yeah, it's right trigger, not left trigger, obviously. Where would it be left trigger? Thank you for putting that there. Not another one of these chambers, please just be a thing. small bead of red wax directly next to the red wax candle tiny pebble of melted wax of a muted crimson prayers muttered in its presence slightly strengthen the vitality of the vera oh every time i do a miracle uh, a prayer i uh, get some health back that's great the abbey ceased to be a quiet place. Cries of pain coming from every cell pierced the walls. The old friar knew he would be next, so he got up from his cot, where he had been huddled, and glanced at the few items that lay on his table, most of them mementos from his life before joining the order. He wanted to be kissed by the miracle while immersed in those gentle thoughts. Triggering most memories were some small balls of wood wax, now covered in dust, that he used to enlarge by picking up wax from candles during processions. That gives me tears of atonement. Slightly better defenses. Oh. Does this say? Wow. How did I end up there? If I go down from the, from from there, ah, uh, I can't go to the right. Okay, I need to find more knots. It said to unlock uh, more parts for the rosemary bead. I might have been just a few steps away from the knots there, but. Hmm. Let's try opening the door in the beginning. I'm really interested in that. That was the first mystery I found and yeah, obviously want to go there. Ah, was this one, yeah.
lockdown there was a thing that I couldn't jump over because I don't have a, a long jump or I don't know how it works might be one of those games I'm refraining from buying the other items because I want that fourth combo head. Oh, I wanted to back off. But that's also okay. We do it that way. didn't move okay ah it can pierce the shields it makes it far more powerful than I imagined it to be Okay, I see that it doesn't really give me lots of tears if I destroy these. Yeah, we hadn't seen that execution animation yet, but we've seen it now. Great. Albero. Do you have something else to turn in? Uh, no quest items. There's the linen cloth. We don't need that. We got that here. Nothing else. Okay. Yeah, that's far too too far away from that. But I don't know how to interact with that lever up there. So that could have been the problem. Go back. Oh, now? <clears throat> what? Um, nope. I'm going out again. <clears throat> <coughs> because I want to do this first so I spawn here and not back there okay let's go into this okay This place is another dream, penitent one. They believe me a saint, worthy of devotions, and the only thing I granted to their prayers was the saltpeter that runs through the stark land and rises through our bodies. The punishment of the miracle for the false idol is to grant them false holiness. Do not try to obtain my name, for it is also covered in salt. Bring me anything that can be blessed, so you might crush this fate of mine and let me cross to the other side of this false dream. Give him the linen cloth. I assume yes. Behold the linen cloth that soaks the sweat of fevers, of thoughts, of dreamt sins. A tool that obtains secret and forbidden confessions, even from those who already departed to the other side of the dream. In the name of the High Wills, I bless this relic. Watch over it, for it is now pure and sacred. The Shroud of Dreamt Sins. 
equip relics to change your perception of the world. Each relic possess differ possesses differ possess each relic possess processes different unique effects, and you can equip up to three of them at the same time. Relics. Yellowish fabric witness to febrile confessions. It still quivers in the face of tortured souls, allowing one to listen to those who can lo no longer speak. Febrile as he was, he hardly noticed someone had sat down next to him. A gentle hand patted a white cloth on his forehead. It was a fabric of the utmost softness, which allowed light through it as if it were a sheet of paper, and was soaking his feverish sweat and providing such relief that he couldn't help but fall asleep. When the cloth was soaked, the nun got up and handed it to the mother superior, adding, with this we will be able to have his confession. And I can now speak to ghosts. Bring me anything that can. Okay, and we have nothing else that can be blessed. Oh, are we seeing the cloth now on our body? Or is it how we look when we're here? That white thing around our neck. I think. Let's check if that's new. There's still a white cloth there. Does it have whiter shine? No, I think there's nothing new there. Uh, no need to, to rest here. We wanted to check those doors in the beginning of the game. Clavicle of Dalhuisian the school child. Dalhuis Dalhuisen. They searched for him for de for days until they found Mark's remains in the woods. Since then rumors tell of demons riding on the backs of flying goats coming from faraway lands. There's more stuff down here. But this is a way back. Or if we have some kind of flying ability. This shows us that there's more to that side. Did I land on that with a down attack? I still can't constantly do the, the fall attack, like, it doesn't work. Go from here to there. No. No. Does it only work if there's an enemy there? I assume it's here. But how do I do the damn falling attack?
No, it's more, it has to be more to the right. But the door down there was closed. The door that I'm thinking about. Too much air control. Okay, so that's not the breakable stuff. The breakable stuff was the texture we had here before. But I didn't really look at it because I didn't expect it to be breakable. Okay, so we have to have an ability to get over there. No idea how. Oh, we got our prayer before this to be able to go there. Okay, we are now returning to the start of the game. These are tanky. These are more tanky than these stupid thingies. The big guys with the statues clubbing us. Nice number in the upper right corner. The Brotherhood of the Silent Sorrow. I've used the key. And we can now enter. The blood perpetuated in sand is the item we get from this. Preserve blood with miraculous properties. With the passage of its bearer, new latches are revealed, formerly invisible to the beholder's eyes. The miracle is truly unfathomable, and no one knows the origin of the blood that swirls around the wearer's feet. New latches? Take this back and fill it with sand, now imbue it with the blood spilling from these dead dreadful wounds so it will turn crimson red, with it you will show the way through these dry lands to those who are yet to follow. Leave me now, I want to say my prayers, for I will soon be joining the dry sap of these roots that painfully embrace our father. And equip it. new ledges are so there are no tutorial ledges in this room but the first room of the game had some something to the upper left not this one this was the boss fight room this was the shrine room those don't didn't even give Stuff of the kind that was shown upon on them are ah, this was movement tutorial room. Was this the starting room? Yeah. Okay, let's see. New ledges should have appeared. There. Okay, it's near those blood flies. I've I haven't I've seen them in one other place. Okay. But I think we'll need something more to get over there. Did we have No, I'm second guessing myself. Uh, whatever. I was thinking about the red belt being the relic, but no, it was there before. 
I remember something tangling around my waist. Okay, now we know how they look if I don't have the relic equipped and how they look if I have it equipped. So that's great. We can now leave. I still think that's a nice number that we have up there in the upper right corner. I rested here, didn't I? Even a wise then however, what sorrowful be nothing new. We already rested here on the entryway. There was two items that we couldn't get to. Oh, are we unlocking the shortcut to the Mea Culpa Shrine? By doing this? There was two items I'm thinking about. Yeah. Yeah. And one of them was this one. We get the painted wood bead. That's a bead for the mo rosemary. Rosary bead. Sphere covered in yellow garnish, the ship paint betrays its origin, home oak of the forest of the holy line. It recovers health when it destroying surrounding objects. We call this pilgrimage route the trail. Our wagons have already passed through here, and the tracks have gotten deep enough to even unearth the shocky sand that lay hidden under the thick forest, such that if one could see it from above, it would look like a long ochre line crossing the wood. Um, where are we now map-wise? Okay, we still have to go. I still couldn't do a plunging attack. I think something is broken about it, because maybe it just does work if, it, if I aim directly down. And if I'm even slightly diagonal. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that. Could you please grab that ledge? You please go away no can you please send me up there oh duck and hit could have come up with that okay there's a thing over there but how do I get there Oh, if I point directly up before, we'll get more height. How does this work? Come on. Okay. Hmm. I see what to do, but not how to do it, so... We might get another ability. I'm hitting everyone, of course. Wait. I should still kill all of you. Oh, I was at the sweet spot for the one guy there. 
just outside of his reach, but in reach myself. Okay. We didn't find any weird relics to turn into relics. There was something up here that we might want to... No, oh, okay. Maybe down and that? No. Oh. No chance. What are you? What are those little ones that seem to hide up in the ceilings amongst the ornaments of the altars? When I call them, they do not appear to pay me any mind. They're covered in ribbons that give the impression of fluttering on an invisible and perceptible constant wind. At times I hear them cry and at times I hear them laugh. What are you, O creatures of the divine grace? Okay. These are the bodies that I can speak to, so that was what we saw also in that starting room. Let's see if we have some of them down here, but I doubt it because I don't remember seeing dead people. Yes, of course. Chasium of Persian, the bandit. Feared by his countrymen, Persian attacked roots without distinction between rich and poor and always alone. The day he dragged himself to a barrel on the brink of death, no one took pity on him. Does this go? Desecrated sister, new place. Okay. And this goes towards... Uh, uh, towards... One more place even? Collectible room. Shows me how many collectibles I've got. Okay. Hey. Good find this one. Okay. So. Next time. We're gonna continue in the. Desecrated system. So. See you then. See you tomorrow. Have a nice day.